Hey guys, what's going on? Um, today's episode is going to be talking about terminal tackle and what you can um, do with it. What is terminal tackle, first of all? Terminal tackle is your hooks, your weights, your jig heads, your, I don't know, swivels, your snap swivels, your accessories your for uh, fishing. Now, terminal tackle comes in all uh, different, different ways and sizes. that you can store your terminal tackle. Are uh, they make these little uh, puck shaped things? Uh, they come in uh, five dividers, and um, well, this specific one comes in five dividers, and you can use this for littler hooks. Um, I use this for bluegill fishing. I put my smaller weights, my smaller hooks, uh, swivels, and whatever else I put in here. Then you move up to a, uh, a tackle box, and with these tackle boxes, you can put dividers in them, and you can use these to store your bass hooks, your weights, your tungsten, your jig heads. Uh, these are really good for kind of just a day trip. And then you move up to the big boys. Um, uh, these are uh, bigger size tackle boxes, and these can hold more than the smaller size. And uh, I put my in this one. I have uh, jig heads and weights, and I just put my uh, jig heads in here. Um, but yeah, terminal tackle is one of the most important things whether you're bluegill fishing or going fishing for sturgeon up in uh, colder waters so basically uh, you got diff you got your different size weights and you got your different size hooks and all that other fun stuff um, a cool idea for keeping terminal tackle uh, organized is using. Uh, now, this. if you don't know what this is, this is basically a uh, uh, shelf liner for your, for your dishes uh, and stuff that you put at home. You take some of this, cut it down to the size of your box, and it keeps all of your stuff nice and organized. I did not come up with this idea. I got this from Fluke Master. Uh, thank you. Um, this has literally been the most helpful thing I've had because I can put all my terminal tackle in and not have to worry about my hooks and my si different size hooks getting mixed up and I can just keep it organized and so I can, when I get on the water I can just say okay I need this hook let's go tie it on and let's go fishing and I'm not going to spend an hour and a half uh, trying to find my hooks so yeah, basically what you do with this is you cut it out to the size of your box. You take your box, and before you uh, put it down, you make sure that it fits in the size of the box. This one does not fit, this is just a scrap. And then you basically get, um, I'm going to see if you can find them. You get these, these are uh, mounting squares that you can get at a, a hobby store like Walmart, uh, or a hobby store. Um, they're little adhesive squares that are two-sided. You put two of them on each corner, and then stick them stick them to your tackle box, and they work absolutely great for keeping this stuck to your box. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that tip. Um, another thing with these uh, bigger size tackle boxes more than just is hooks and weights and other stuff. Uh, in here, I have, if I need to replace uh, Colorado blades, I have some spare Colorado blades. I have some spare beads and a spare uh, spinner part for my uh, spinner baits. Um, I keep uh, different size leaders in here because you never know when you're going to run into some of that uh, thicker stuff or you're going for game fish. I keep snells. Now, snells are kind of a cool invention. They're kind of like a... They're a pre-tied hook that you... It's basically like a trailer hook, but it's... It's longer. And, um... 
they're really nice for when you're trying to extend your uh, range of your hook. They keep that really nice and organized. Another cool tip that you can do with uh, terminal tackle is you can organize it by weight, size, density, uh, tungsten, lead, anything basically. You get yourself one of those label makers, but um, you get your label maker and you cut off okay, three eighths right, you know, ounce uh, tungsten. Stick that on to the box where your three eighths ounce tungsten is. Put that in, and then you can just easily grab it, put it on your line, and go fishing. Um, yeah, it's terminal tackle is one of the most important things for fishing. Without it, we would not be able to fish. You couldn't use your hooks for crankbaits or spinnerbaits. Uh, you couldn't use weights for drop shot fishing. Uh, you couldn't use jig heads for uh, like shaky head fishing and finesse fishing. So without terminal tackle, we do not have a successful fishing uh, season. Um, like I always say, uh, be sure to uh, check me out, uh, go subscribe to my YouTube channel, um, check me out on Google+, and uh, have a great day!